And the first one, as you've identified, is strategy. And strategy for me answers the question, what's the plan? So, you know, if I'm sitting with you as a, as a leader in terms of BPO and say, so, so Nick, what's the plan? That should be able to be clear, concise, and communicated and understood by everyone in the team. And I occasionally do this where I'm, I'm working with a leadership team offsite in a boardroom somewhere. And I say, so is everyone clear on what the plan is, what the vision is, where, where we're heading? And they go, oh yes, of course they are. So, okay, let's ring them. So I grab my mobile phone, put them on loudspeaker and ring, ring you know, phone back to the company. And I say, hi, I'm just here with your leaders. Just wondering what's the, what's the, the game plan? Where are you heading? What do you actually want to achieve? I'll put you through to someone else. So I get transferred two or three times and finally the leaders say, okay, I get it. We think they're clear, but are they actually clear on what the strategy is? And look, I'm big on a one page plan. Um, there's a, a one page plan on our website at uh, michaelsheargold.com that, the, that you can jump on and, and download. And it, that really helps with that. The other tool that's there uh, at the moment, Nick, is a SWOT analysis tool. And it goes in a little bit more depth than, you know, SWOT simply means strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats. Now is the perfect time to do some resetting on that, get some leadership, uh, key people in the business together and say, okay, what are our strengths? What are our opportunities? Uh, you know, what are our weaknesses and what are the threats and how do we capitalize on that? So the, the SWOT navigation system is, is in place there, but I'm big on a one page. And ultimately the strategy needs to be, well, how are we going to deliver value? And Nick, I might just bring up, um, my iPad and uh, uh, just draw this model for you. It's one of our core business growth models. And assuming we've now got a blank screen. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So with strategy uh, in business, you've either got a, um, a, a who are we serving? What is it they want and how are we going to deliver that? So we start with the who, you know, the avatar of, of who, or we might start as what is it that we are best in class in? What are we best in the, in the world in? If this is what we, we're best in the world, well, who is it that's going to be most interested in that? And then how do we connect with them in the most effective way? So it's pretty simple. And this, this really, for me, is the delivery model of getting clear on what your strategy is. What is it we, we're delivering? Who is it to? And there. Now, if we actually wrap around that is why is that important and what's our why? You know, Simon uh, Sinek kind of mode of getting clear on the heart of we believe this or this is what we're actually out to achieve. And we bring that into play into a very simple sort of X factor model of firstly, we've got marketing. Then we've got a, a, a selling system. Then we've got a a delivering system, and then we've got an ongoing uh, servicing system. So you put this into perspective, and by the way, anyone who's tuned in, you could rate yourself now on those four, and I guarantee that will tell you what's holding back the strategy from being realized. You might have the best delivery system, but you're not telling anyone about it from a marketing point of view. So you're the you're you're the secret agent. And most businesses, you don't want to be a secret agent. You want to be known out there in the marketplace. And then it might be we're getting a great lead flow coming into selling, but the problem is our conversion, or we might be getting the wrong leads coming in. So our marketing's off in terms of who we're bringing in because they're not the ideal who for what we actually want to, to deliver on. So. Then the selling system and you know what's an acceptable conversion in, in your business to make sure we're now delivering. The key with delivering, I talk about deliver plus one in, what, in such a way that we have a, a wow factor build. So uh, wow, these guys are impressive. And look, um, word of mouth uh, is known as the best and worst marketing in the world today. I think we can up it now, Nick, to, to world of mouth because if I have a great experience, I'm probably going to pop that on social. I've had a bad experience. I'm definitely popping that up on social. So more people get to know about it. And then what's the ongoing servicing structure and servicing framework that's going to deliver this from a long-term point of view? Now, what's interesting with this, to me, serving is selling and selling is serving. And also what's happened because of social is marketing has become closer to servicing. So, so 
the mode is what level of service could I offer my ideal future client before they need my service? So we start to think about the, the value in this. And you know, my, my fundamental belief is value, 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 sell. So what's the value framework that we're creating there that have people you know, massively attracted to our business um, we're known in the marketplace in a way that we're, we're building amazing momentum from a marketing point of view. Uh, and, you know, the, the key thing is, depending on the product or service, uh, you know, we can look at, well, you know, do we want uh, more clients? Do we want them to repeat more of, want them to buy more per transaction? So we play around with that in the, in the process of, of how we build greater value in this. But Nick, to me, the strategy answers the question, what's the plan? Who are we targeting? What is it we're delivering? Uh, why is that important to us? And then ultimately the ability for us to share that with the team so they can see their why in our why. So they're plugging in, not putting a brick in the wall, not building a wall. My goodness, we're out to create this cathedral and I'm excited about what we can actually do. Sense of belonging, sense of purpose in, in how we're heading.